All right, the countdown for midterms is on. This Sunday, former President Donald Trump will host a rally in Mesa, Arizona, in support of GOP candidates for the November elections. That's right. Trump-backed Republican nominee for Arizona Attorney General Abe Hamaday will be speaking at that rally. Abe, welcome. Thanks so much for Thanks. coming on. How are you feeling? Good. Thank you for having me on. Your big speech is coming up here on Sunday. Uh, Trump's doing two rallies, one in Nevada on Saturday, I believe, and then one in, on Sunday in Arizona. This is the one you're going to be speaking at. What do Arizonans want to hear from you and from the former president? Well, I think right now, you know, he was, we had the honor to have President Trump at an earlier rally back in July. So it's a treat to have him out here twice before the general election. But going into the general election right now, I think right, Arizonans, they want to see optimistic future. And we don't want to become California like San Francisco or Los Angeles with rolling energy blackouts, with homelessness on the streets, with the rising crime. So, you know, what I'm going to be talking about, what other candidates are going to be talking about is this new vision for Arizona. It's this Arizona bold era. And we're ushering a new generation of political outsiders like myself, Carrie Lake, Blake Masters. So you know, Arizona is going to be on the front, uh, front page because of all the bold ideas that are going to come out of it. But you know, we're on the front lines here in Arizona dealing with the fentanyl crisis, the rise in homelessness. So Arizona's better days are coming ahead of us. Mm. Uh, early voting, again, I believe that's set to start out next week through mail-in uh, balloting. So again, you've got people who are uh, awaiting for Election Day to cast their ballot, but you can also do so earlier on. I wanted to get your reaction to this latest federal appeals court ruling. It declares this, the DACA program illegal, but it leaves policy intact for nearly 600,000 immigrant dreamers. President Biden calling the ruling unlawful. What do you have to say about it? Well, I think President Biden doesn't really know the law all that well. And, you know, we've seen this time and time again. Just the other week, if you remember, state AGs sued the Biden administration for the, the supposed loan forgiveness. And finally, the Biden administration had to push pull back on it because they, it, they realized it was going to be challenged in court and not uh, not actually go into constitutional grounds. So, you know, this doesn't surprise me, but this is exactly why state AGs are so much more powerful than ever before. We're leading the charge against Washington, D.C. right now at the state level. And that's why President Trump's going to come to the rally on Saturday, because he recognizes now more than ever, having good leaders at the statewide office is going to save our country. Really quickly, before you go, I wanted to throw up a tweet that you sent out, a concern for you, saying, today my campaign called for an ethics investigation of the Arizona Republic. Trust in the media is at an all-time low. We hope there is still honest journalists who value the truth over propaganda. There must be accountability. Uh, tell me about this tweet, uh, and what are you looking for? Well, absolutely. So last week, you know, we actually had a debate, me and my opponent, and it was sponsored by the Clean Elections Commission, which is taxpayer funded. But they had the Arizona Republic as moderators. And I'm OK with tough questions. You know, I think that's reasonable in politics. But we also want fairness, honesty and integrity. And the Republic failed to disclose that my opponent used to work at that newspaper as a journalist. I mean, she was so dishonest that even John McCain kicked her off the, the Straight Talk Express back in 2000. So, you know, I, I think right now we called for the Arizona Newspaper Association to uh, have an investigation on, on ethic complaints because, you know, right now the media is so dishonest in Arizona. So we just want honesty and fairness to be covered on both sides. Hmm. A big race in Arizona. You talk about your own as attorney general, uh, what you're hoping to become, and then also the governor's race and the Senate race there as well. We are watching closely as we are now just over a month away. Abe Hamaday, thanks so much for coming on today. Appreciate it. Thank you. You're welcome. No crooked, crooked establishment. establishment. None of that Twisting, twisting the truth. truth. No talking down don't to me. Don't tell me how to think. Don't tell me how to think. Don't tell me how to think. I trust Newsmax. Newsmax. They don't tell, tell me, me how, how to think. think. They let, let me decide. Newsmax. Real news. For real people.